A Day in the Life It's morning. I'm typically the first one up in my family that consists of Jacob Kitty, Michael Hubby, and Caleb Dog. Let's get it. After getting up, Jacob Kitty immediately demands his door be opened, but every self-respecting cat knows that it's more important to have your human open human doors whenever possible, and Jacob is no different. Everybody out. I usually pause to enjoy the beautiful scenery out the back door, but not for long. There's lots of business that needs to be taken care of before I can get ready for work. Next up is... There he is. Give me that paper. Give me that paper. Thank you. And right after Caleb's breakfast... <laughs> you want to go for a walk? <laughs> Caleb, do you want to go for a walk? Here we go. We enjoy the activity and the surrounding beauty during that morning walk, enjoying the fields, the canyons, the wildlife. But, of course, it's soon time to head back to the house and get ready for work. But next up is my daily devotional, and then it's getting ready for work. I'm ready to report for duty now. Okay, and now I'm ready, ready to shine, and I'm only getting bigger and better and up the line. Got a bright light in the top right of my mind. Everybody watch out, cause it's my time, and I'm never giving it up. I'm never gonna stop. I'm never giving it up. I start with a quick tour of the greenhouse. Looks like the poinsettias have been planted. We have fingerlings ordered for the fish hatchery. And the, none of the tanks are leaking. Check out the rest of the plants. The students have been busy and the tomatoes are growing well. So we're all set. My days are full of emails, reports, phone calls, more emails and reports, checking in with faculty. Looks like the line work students are warming up. I head out to meet one of the uh, equine instructors and see how the class is going. Looks like we have a mule. And of course the meetings, staff meetings, meetings with faculty, meetings with other organizations such as a high school superintendent to talk about getting their students into our construction class. And after all the emails and meetings and visits with faculty, it's time finally to head for home after a fast-paced day. Just getting out the door and I run into one of our faculty heading in to teach her service dog class. And then it's off to the house. And I'm home. I'm home. Hi, Caleb. Oh. And my evening usually consists of some sort of food preparation. Tacos is one of my husband's favorites, unless the ribeye are on sale. And then I don't have to cook. And next up is Art 139 homework. Yikes! And finally the family gets to settle down in the living room, have a little visit, watch a little TV, watch our favorite YouTube channel with SV Delos.
Hey, you know what we should do in two years when you retire? What? We should buy another boat and cruise the South Pacific again. Okay. We can call it the South, South Pacific, Pacific Reboot. Reboot.